This is another new Black World Order TV productions. Uh-huh. Yes, what's happening, homie? Hey, what's up, fam? Let's get it in. Let's get it in. So now, the subject is, can you prove that there were beings in another galaxy, not that there is another galaxy, for I agree that there is another galaxy, but bring me something tangible, some type of evidence that I could hold in my hand, bear witness with my eyes that some beings existed in this galaxy that I know exists. Okay. Produced is it, it my time? Yes, sir. Okay. First of all, there is an abundant amount of evidence to prove that beings existed from other galaxies. One, there is no dispute that there are multiple galaxies, that this solar system... That's not is, what I'm let arguing me finish. against. Let me finish, because you asked the question, and let me answer it the way I want to answer it. Because you, you're saying, bring me something tangible to say, to prove that you know, uh, beings... Just like we ask the Israelites finish. for their bodies, I need something tangible. Okay, I'm telling you, there are, there's evidence, there are bodies, there are crafts that exist, that NASA, that uh, military personnel, commanders, colonels, uh, uh, there, there's a, a, a group called the Disclosure Project. There's a group that I'm you can Google called that. the Disclosure Project where there are hundreds, if not thousands of testimonies from military personnel who have eyewitness account of vehicles from other planets. They got eyewitness accounts of beings that they found because ships have crashed. There are there, there is debris that have been found that is on film that that um, crafts have landed or have crashed and beings have been taken out and they are and, and they are being dissected. This is this is not just one one account but multiple accounts. Look at the disclosure project. Also look at the Thrive um, the seen Thrive let me finish, all over. the Thrive uh, movement video or Thrive.com T H R I V E. Look at that video, and it will show you tangible things that prove the existence of beings who exist on other, in other worlds, including pyramids that exist on Mars, right, which we don't have the technology. No man has landed on Mars from uh, planet Earth. No man has landed on Mars. No, no man, maybe a, a machine has landed on Mars, but no man has landed on Mars. So the pyramids up there is proof that there are beings with superior technology that uh, that built pyramids, the same um, structures that are here in um, on this planet, on this planet, same structures that they can't prove how they were built also exist on Mars, including a face of a human, which we say was the making of the Adama project, the cloning of man, which is a symbol of this thing. So there is um, there is thousands of, and not to mention the um, crop circles that are found all over the world that is impossible to make those geometrical shapes by human hand from the ground. And there are some that have tried to make these um, crop circles and they don't even compare uh, even close to the real crop circles that are found that can only be made from something that is coming from above. Now, as far as Iliun is concerned, there is mention of Iliun in the Quran. The in word the Iliun. In the Quran? In the Quran. There is mention of the word Iliun. They call it the place where records are I got you. You can Google Iliun. So there is a star uh, system called Iliun. Now, as far as me having something physical in my hand to say, oh, this is a rock from Iliun, I cannot do that. But based say on. Say that again. Based on having something you in my hand, what? in my you hand, can I can't do that. do that. But based on what I know as as uh, right knowledge, right wisdom, and right understanding, which is based on evidence, experience, and common sense, there's enough evidence to support where I don't have to believe that beings exist on another planet. But there's enough evidence to support that that is a that is a fact. And if uh, if a being come and tell me somebody who is like Malachi who has written more books than anybody in the history of human existence, the number one author, and they say, well, uh, Malachi just had uh, quoted or had his ghost, secretary. Ghost writers. Ghost writers, but nobody, even, nobody has even done that. Had ghost writers write hundreds right. and hundreds okay. of books. Okay, I'm going to make it a little nobody more difficult. Nobody has done that. I'm going to make this so a little more difficult. Based on the pure information that Malachi brought to this planet, 
I would, at this point, I could accept, and the evidence that has been presented, I can accept that my, our species came from another galaxy. Would you agree with this? I'm going I'm, I'm to say it this way. Yes. If somebody came and told me that the Pittsburgh Steelers had a franchise in another galaxy, would I be wrong for asking for a helmet with the insignia on it? Would I be wrong? I couldn't say no. Of course, I you wouldn't be wrong, be wrong, wrong for so asking. Could you? Could I know you said Ron. you couldn't produce nothing in your hand. Ron, me personally. But can you produce no. uh, authentic, genuine photograph or something? Uh, something from a 19th galaxy with this type of writing on it right here. Or this yes, one. yeah, I've seen a crop I'm talking circle. About hold it. I'm, I'm, no. I'm, no, I'm talking about not on this planet. Well, listen, I'm bro, about, I'm um, never telling you that yeah. I physically, my physical right. body went to Ilion. I'm right. not saying that. Right. I'm saying there's enough information to prove that Ilion exists, that there is a 19th you galaxy. You got me? I'm not, I'm I'm not saying, denying that there's multiple galaxies. You got me? We're in agreement on that. We're in agreement, agreement that on that. beings from other worlds. I would agree with that, too. Okay, so but, we're, it What's doesn't mean that they like the Pittsburgh still. Well, we, you talking about right. rivals and something oranges Something from there. here. You talking about football. No, I'm talking about yeah, something yeah. I can see on this planet corresponding with the insignias on that planet to show me that they're... Well, like I said, right. like I said, right. the only thing that you can find with the insignia like this, you can find this insignia on crop circles. You right. can find this exact insignia on crop circles that cannot be scientifically proven, yes, that cannot be scientifically proven was made on Earth or from Earth. Right. Just this I mean, symbol I'm exact. And I'm talking about the geometric um, shape of it is impossible to make by human hand. So this is just one of the symbols that have been found. But you got to be, you got to, you got to Google it now. Now that symbol again, was found in a crop circle you. on this planet. Huh? That was found in a crop circle on this. Planet. Yes. Yeah, gotcha. you can find this symbol on a crop circle that was found in Europe. Right in this planet. Yes. Yes. Right. From from high, you have to see it from a overview, which right. they captured. Just like the Nazca line. Yes. Yeah, just like this. Yeah. Just like. Right. So there are beings who are coming with this type of knowledge, that's coming with this type of knowledge. Now, based on the fact that I have tapped into the highest level of consciousness, based on my experience, I can tell, and based on most, most humans have not reached this level because they're still stuck in mind, I can conclude that there is something genetically different about me because I've been, I've experienced abduction. I've met extraterrestrials personally. I've experienced that myself. Now, so, if I ever meet an extraterrestrial personally and get yeah. abducted, I got questions for them too. Yeah. And you know what the I biggest understand. question I got? What's the biggest question? Where is the iPhone 30? Where's the iPhone 30? Yeah. Okay. Fuck all the bullshit. I'm What's trying to get paid. Okay. Right? I got you. So if I had the iPhone 30, because we know that the Arcturians, right? Uh, some people say they white, you know. And they got different groups talking about different alien species or races on Earth that came from outer space. And then they got people saying that their beings gave them technology, right? That's why we see the rapid increase of technology on the planet, they say. But why the black aliens don't give us no technology? I just want the app on third. Well, you just because you are not aware of the technology of extraterrestrials. No, I'm not questioning the existence. No, I'm saying, saying how come they don't give it to us? They are giving it to us. I'm talking about. Yes. Wait a minute. But you, you might not be aware of you because you're dealing with you and your subconscious. So why are we all here scrambling if we got that technology? Because you, 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 you have to right now. <laughs> because you can't handle it. You have to raise. That's the suffering. Doctor. You have to raise. And consciousness because if they give you technology in your current state, you will destroy. No, I would not me. I'm not talking about you personally, even though you know, I'm talking about. I will get us a salary, Negros, man, so we can get off the Negros job. Negroes and the mentality and the conditioning of the mind of the Negro right now, he can't handle higher technology. He will destroy. He will go around bragging, showing not off, me. trying to make money. You know how. No, no, making money ain't nothing wrong with they making money. Bling, bling, every damn thing. So they don't have the. This is why the Anunnaki, the story of the Elohim, is to raise you in consciousness so that you can be able to handle. Handle the technology that they're bringing. So they, the they other aliens that gave technology to their people on Earth. Yes, this is their God. They feel that they need but, technology to advance themselves, but we can't have none. No, 
The beings that are getting the technology now, there are multiple species of extraterrestrial. Some are called uh, grays, some are called, um, there's a very violent species. Um, I can't think of the name right now, but a lot of the government is getting technology that they from different species, but they are of war. And so, the, like Adolf Hitler, if you research Adolf Hitler, he was flying, firing saucers during his time. Yeah. So he was getting the technology from some From Venus? He, well, the Venerians, that's what the story lies Yeah, I saying. heard that before. That's right. So they, so the Venetians Oh, gave, the Satanists. The they, Satanists. Whoever, they gave say, their people technology. Yeah, because we ain't they got want no you technology. to blow. They, try, they are being gods of war. We're back to the man of war. I don't want to go to war with the technology. Yeah. I want to use it. You do. I don't want to go war with the technology. Listen, bro, again. You think I'll fight with it? Huh? You think I'll fight with it? I yes, am a fire fan. I am yes, a fire fan. Yes, but if you go back to the war in L.A., if you go back to the L.A., what they call, you can Google this, they call an uh, alien ship in L.A. back in, 60, in the 60s or even before, what they call it, the, uh, I call it the Battle of L.A., where they capture a spacecraft, a circular spacecraft, hovering over L.A., or the oceans of L.A. This is, you can Google this, this is real footage, this actually happened, they had a spaceship hovering over L.A., they call it the Battle of L.A., Google it, and when they, when the, the people of this planet, the Army, shot millions of missiles at this structure, they had a force field that bounce those those uh, mortal ass weapons uh, bullets off them. It didn't even scratch the surface. Well, that's the type of shit so I'm the, telling so you to tell the aliens to give the, us. It's, it's based on the tetrahedron science of magnetism. Okay. But base, but but so that goes to tell us that they don't need to give you weapons of mass destruction. They could just because they know that you will hurt yourself. No, I want weapons your, of your mass self mind. defense. We have that. We have that. They shooting the shit out of us. No, yeah, well, you and have to raise up. And the bullets don't bounce off, can you? You have to raise up. You have to prove that you don't want to be a nigga no more. That's why you if say you give me the iPhone you 30, I'll shit. show you. The iPhone 30, that's mortality technology. That's, that's mortality right, technology. It can get me How above $15 an hour, though. How about zero point energy where we can feed well, all Well, that shit, too. Matter. I want tell them to give us that shit, too. Well, we have that. Tesla was trying to bring that. I ain't talking about Tesla. Tesla was about trying to bring that along with other people. The, na the black... Malachi, man, the beam. Malachi didn't who, bring no technology. Malachi did bring he the didn't technology. didn't wear the technology. Because yet. you don't know about it doesn't mean that it wasn't brought. Oh, it's a secret technology. It's not a secret technology. I said you don't know about it. It might be a secret to you, but Malachi had the, the knowledge and still do. Did he have anything far superior than that's an why iPhone 30? They want, that's why they want, locked him up and put him under the cell because of the technology that he was bringing. But his no, I'm talking about an appliance, a device. I ain't talking about the technology of right sound reasoning. A, no, I understand. I'm what talking, you're talking about a about. device. I know what you're talking about. Well, that's what they were talking about, the Ark of the Covenant. When you talk about the Ark of the Covenant, oh, that's about, old shit. I want a, some new shit. Well, you have to raise up first. You have to raise up in consciousness to get this information. Man, this hell technology. no. The other aliens get their people shit, and they ain't gotta raise yeah, up. Yeah, but their time is up. Their time is up. And they employing their, their time people. Time is up. Simi Valley in California. Yeah. Did the aliens drop them something? Must be did. Why would you say they must? Because that's where the most of the computer shit is coming out too. Well, they stealing computers. They found computers on the moon. They found computers on the moon, very advanced. They finding computers. So on, was our let, people let on let the moon? Finish. They finding computers on these spacecraft that have crashed, and 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 they're pulling the technology out, and they got them in their laboratories, and they dissecting them, and they do. But what about them. our shit? I don't want to hear about what uh -huh. they got. They, I want to know you where our shit. You keep talking about at. our shit. Our shit is their shit too. Our shit. It's being given to so us. So why the aliens ain't crashed their shit in our backyard so we could have it? How you know they have it? Just because all, you don't know all, about listen, it. Listen, man, I Just do because not. because you don't know about man, it. Man, the black dude that developed the uh, cell phone. Yeah. How about all this technology that black people are inventing? How do you know they're not given to them by these extraterrestrials? Uh, because I don't if think you, so. if you if you do your research, I don't think so. most of the most of the advances that we made. I think we just smart ass people. people, man. So now, yeah, because you only think. I'm giving us credit. I ain't gonna keep giving credit to something else other than our people. But they are us, the extraterrestrials. I'm talking then about. Then tell them bring the iPhone 30 down here that now. That like, they're here. I'm one of them. Well, we need a hundred of them. I need a hundred of them right I'm now. I'm one of them. 
Look, I'm, I'm in training. If I had the iPhone 30 right now for $500, would you copy? No. Yes, you would. <laughs> yes, you would. Would you do what? If I had the iPhone 30 right now uh, for $500, wouldn't you buy it if you had the money? Not me. I'm, I'm talking not about not the iPhone like 6. Like he said, I'm not interested I'm talking about the iPhone. iPhone. Yes, you would. I would. I'm, I'm not See, interested. He ain't interested. I'm not he ain't interested. interested. Neither am I. I know. That's why. I'm not interested in things that I can't All right, watch advance this. What time of morning? What, did, what time is it? Yes. It's a I said, I'm talking about the iPhone 30. It ain't came out yet. But this is my point. How much money you got in your pocket this morning? Why? Right. Is you full up this morning? No. Okay. That's Ask my me. point. I'm not. The, the money. I know you full of uh, I got the vibe a bit and of the money. Beans. No, I got a little bit of money, but the money ain't even real money. It's paper. It's well, not even real. I understand it's all that. I understand it's all that. That's why I have. That's why I, I've reduced my intake of food. Let, this is my, what, uh, 22nd day of fasting, where I don't eat every day. I, don't, I reduce my intake because I've raised to a level of consciousness that I don't have to eat like mortal men. Huh? Go ahead, keep talking. The battery's ready to go dead. Just okay. keep talking. Well, I'm raising myself up to a, le a level of consciousness where money, I won't need the money to survive. And that's what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to raise ourselves up to a supreme level of being so that we won't need their How stuff much anymore. money did Malachi Z. York have on him when they arrested him? I don't know what he had on they him. They say he had over $200,000. No, that was on, on the land. That wasn't in his pocket. On the land, it was on the land grand. or in his pocket. They found 250 grand on Why the land. Why did he need that much money? Malachi if you're not didn't interested need in that money. Much money. I'll tell you. Why would an alien that, need that, that, that much money? I'm going to answer that. Because the money was for the people. Bob, that's listen, what I'm I talking knew about. Him. I'm I talking knew about him. that too, King. Well, I understand that. You, now, you, you know me and you feed you people. You need right? money. Me and you feed you homeless need, people. You right? need it to pay for right. in order to build the structure. That's what I'm and talking about, King. I understand King. that. I understand that. That's because they put the value on it and we accept it. Now, if we now, had the iPhone 30 right no, now, if we didn't believe we in the money. We could build some shit by selling that iPhone no, 30, wouldn't we? If we didn't believe in. If we. All we have to do. Is not Man, believe listen, in their you money. You wouldn't even have to look we for a job. We could cut trees. You right now. We could go in the woods, cut our own trees, and make our own shit. We could take the sun and use that energy. I'm to just saying, fuel. Let's, we could get water out if, of the ground. If you met an alien, why ain't it happening? It is happening. Just because you don't know about Man, it doesn't mean it don't happen. That's I need, I need a job. I can sell that shit. You know I'm a natural born salesman. Yeah. Listen, if you gave me the iPhone 30, I could dump 100,000 of them bitches this week. And I could... Yeah, what would you do? What would Let I do? Let me tell you. When I ask me, what would you what do I would if you do. had a billion dollars right if now? If I had a billion dollars yeah. right now, tell me what would you do? I would attempt. Yeah. I would attempt. Uh-huh. The greatest effort of nation building among our people that the world has ever seen, even attempt. that which I'm going to say attempt, because it would only be for those who want it. Those who need it don't want it, so that attempt who would be, be in a charge. What, who would be in charge? Yeah. A enlightened council of elders would be, not one being. The enlightened council of elders. And how would you choose the enlightened? What based makes on, a being enlightened? Based on their character, based on what they have been doing, what I have observed them doing, besides boots on the ground activity. Other than that, I would not select nobody that's just chicken shit and bullshit. Well, and, and you agree would be, with that, right? I, I, I tell you what, you will have to be very careful in your selection. I am. Because I am very corrupts. careful. But you know, I'm very power careful. Power corrupts and money corrupts. And as long as you believe, and brokenness, as long being as you broke believe, corrupts too. As long as you believe being that you are just a physical entity, as long as you believe that you're just a physical entity and that you're separate from the whole, you will be corrupted. That's why I said. Did, no that's why I didn't say I would be the because leader. Because you're lust. Because I'm not looking for that type of power. You're lustful women. I'm not talking about you yeah. per se. I'm talking about people who seek power. People who believe that they're only a physical entity and is controlled by their thoughts and their emotions will eventually corrupt themselves. One of the it things. Always happens. One of the things. It always. One happens. of the things you know I would do. I would fight hunger on the planet. You know I would. Do I know that. you would do that. Right. I, I believe that you are an honorable man. I believe that. But you, you are right. I might get into a, a little war, though. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, 
I know you would. Hey, hey, we, hey, most Negroes be getting high. But I don't. I wouldn't do that bond. because of the they God would, of War. They would, they I'm not doing that because of the God that, of War. That look good to them. Anything that look good, we would indulge. So we have to get beyond. We have to get to a level of consciousness where we don't desire anymore. Nobody if we in told my you council that would I choose to be a that supreme do that. being that you can't have sex anymore. Most niggas will say, "Well, I don't want to be that great." I don't want to be that great. Most niggas. I say, don't. We have to find those who are willing to not indulge if they were, if, if, or at least willing to not indulge. But how do you get there? That's the question. You have to, you have to transcend the human experience because that's what you're here to experience, the human experience. But you're not supposed to stay in that experience. You're supposed to rise above it and become supreme being again. That is extraterrestrial. That's what the extraterrestrials are. There yeah, is the iPhone 30 again. Go ask one of them extra trust. <laughs> Go ask the white man. <laughs> iPhone 30 is gone. Because I don't know. This is an iPhone right. 30. Give so, me a ship that I can travel from here three things to, <laughs> the next, to the 19th galaxy. That's the technology I'm waiting on. No, you shouldn't be waiting on it. Y'all got it. No, yeah, but I, I haven't proved. Obviously, I'm still here in this form, so I haven't raised to that, to right. that level exactly. yet. Or they're not ready to give me that, that type of technology. Right. But I am on that. I know they better not pick me up and put me on a ship. I'm snatching that shit. And that's in your Bible, I'm gonna tell too. Them run that the shit. rapture, the new Jerusalem, the new city of peace. All that is talking about a vehicle coming out your sky to this planet to pick you up. The Israelites so say that, too. But they don't people, believe in science. Uh, yeah, well, they, they believe in that Bible. And that Bible talking about extraterrestrials. No, they believe they a ship. They and they believe a In the book of Numbers, they talking about a ship. The star of Bethlehem that led the wise men is a ship. All that shit is spaceship, cause ain't no star leading you no. All I'm saying, everybody got a fucking ship, but nobody dropped off their iPhone 30 so we can get us some money. Cause being broke will corrupt you. Yes, it will. Yeah, being broke can corrupt you, but if you broke in your spirit, it will corrupt you. Oh shit, I'm but powerful you, in my spirit. If, if you if you strong in your money spirit, money come up the to me. Let's won't get it. Change your level of exactly. Conscience. I agree. I agree. You can exist in the in the so-called hood and still be a happy, peaceful, healthy soul. Because I don't have a bunch of money, and I don't. I, but I. No, you couldn't live I'm in the hood forever. Years old, I'm you couldn't vibrant. live. You couldn't live in that environment forever. I can in there as long as I'm allowed to live in this physical form in there. No, because no, no. at some point I'm going to have to get out there, my Because I'm transcending. Right. I'm transcending right. anyway. Right. So it doesn't matter. You're going to take you to an affluential neighborhood. I don't even live. need to live in the neighborhood. Give me the damn woods. Where nature. Put me in nature. That's an affluential. So look, King, yeah. thanks for coming through. This it's was a nice bill. Raul Bet. Raul Bet. Shalom. Salam. Hotel. RBG. Black Power. And what up to my G's in the street. All that. I'm saying is when you meet an alien, yeah. tell that nigga drop that iPhone 30. Yeah, iPhone 30 yeah. And you need a thousand of them uh, beamed right. into your living room every we, day so you can get it all. Everybody. Black Power. Black Power.